Roll coating is an ideal method of applying thin coats of finished material to flat substrates of wood, metal, and plastic. The principle of roll coating is ancient, based upon the physics of transferring a layer of coating from the surface of a roller to the surface of a substrate. Roll coating is a highly effective method that is both precise in application and environmentally friendly, offering near 100% transfer efficiency. The most common type of roll coder is the differential direct style, where moving components are individually adjusted in speed and direction. This ensures maximum control of the coating process. The process of transferring a layer of coating from the roll requires several key components. A conveyor belt or rolling system moves the substrate under the application roll to enable the film transfer. The application roll carries the coating film which will be transferred to the substrate. The roll is covered with various materials and densities to facilitate the coating application. The metal doctor roll or metering roll works in conjunction with the application roll to form a pocket of coating called the nip. The film thickness on the application roll is determined by the distance between the two rollers and the speed and rotation direction of each roller. A scraper blade may be used to remove the coating from the back of the roll and return to the nip or to keep the coating from dropping onto the conveyor when the doctor roll is run in reverse. Finally, a recirculation system fluid pump pulls coating from a container and pumps it slowly between the rollers into the nip. Machine setup begins with the initial adjustment of the application roll to the desired height. Typically, the application roll is set to a light compression with the substrate. This setting is a function of roll durometer or hardness and substrate texture. Conveyor and application roll speed are set and synchronized based upon production requirements. Since we are setting up to run in the indirect mode, the doctor roll scraper blade is engaged and the roll speed is set. Initial doctor roll rotation speed can be set at a percentage of the conveyor speed and adjusted as required. The distance between the doctor roll and the application roll is then set to create the nip and to meter the film thickness onto the application roll. Coating is loaded and fluid begins circulating in the system through a pickup tube. It is important to have fluid circulating at all times to prevent damage to the application roll. The final adjustment is based on keeping the nip at a constant fluid level, which can be determined visually. A test piece is run. The weight of the coating film is determined by a scale. From the resulting weight, coating adjustments can be determined. These are made by means of the nip, the roller speeds, and the application height. Production is now ready to proceed. A properly set up roll coater is the embodiment of Leonardo da Vinci's maxim that simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. Contact your Stanza Machinery team for detailed requirements and information on roll coding. <music>